Hello, I'm going to walk you through the purchasing process for purchasing of multiple courses and how you can assign or distribute these courses once purchased. You can search and add courses to your cart with ease. To view courses by category, simply select the applicable filter from the menu list here. You can even change the display to a list view to easily add multiple quantities. Once you have the courses you need added to your cart, you'll be prompted to either log in or create an account. If creating an account, you want to ensure that the account is created for yourself, even though you may not be taking any of the purchase training. As the purchaser, you'll have access to the receipt, be in control of the distribution of the purchase courses, and have the ability to see the status of training as well as the certificates of completed courses. Once you've made your purchases, you're going to have the option to determine who will be taking the training. You have multiple options here. If the training is solely for yourself, you can click this option and those courses will automatically be applied to your account. However, if the training is for somebody else, you would select this method here, or you have the third option if the training is for yourself as well as for other users. Simply select the method that applies to you and proceed with the register users process. From the register users section, you will have the ability to either register individuals for the courses that they need with their first name, last name, and an email if you know that information, or you can simply print the instructions directly from this button here. That will generate you all of the instructions that would get mailed, emailed out to an individual instructing them on how to access the training that you've purchased and allowing them to create an account for themselves where this training will be deposited automatically. The other option is to email registration information. From this section here, you'll be able to select which courses are being sent to which individuals. You can select only one course if you only want this specific course to be sent off to individuals. And then in here, you would just simply put their email address. And if you need to, you can comma separate multiple email addresses here. You can also CC yourself on the email as an additional information for yourself. And from this page, you also still have the ability to print and access those instructions. If you need to select another, the second course that you've purchased or other courses that you've purchased or a combination of courses to email the instructions for both courses to be taken, you would simply select both from this option here. Completing this process will send the users this instructions. They will have to create an account for themselves, but once they've done that, the training will be applied to their account. The other method is that you can register the users for the courses. Please note, you do need to have their email addresses in order to do this. The email address is the unique identifier which determines who this training is assigned to. If you enter in your own email address here, the training is going to be assigned to your account. So you want to make sure that you do know the email address for the individuals required to take this training. If you do, you can simply put in their first name, last name, email address here, and once you've completed this, you can simply click register users. In this process, what's going to happen is an account will automatically be created for these individuals and they'll be emailed instructions on how to access this account. From this point, they simply sign in and take the training. You can use a combination of these methods as well. If you make five purchases, but you only know the email address or need to assign three training courses at this time, you would simply fill out three. The rest of these purchases will still be available to be distributed at any time. And I will show you how to access that now. Once you've made your purchases and you need to access your purchase courses and distribute your courses at any time, you can do this simply from your purchases tab. From here, you'll have your order number complete with your date and you'll have the ability to access your receipt and email off the course codes to anybody who needs to take the training if you still have remaining courses to be used. To gain more details on this, you would simply click the date or the green down arrow on the far right to expand the information available here. 
In this display, you'll see all of the courses purchased in this order, the course code that corresponds to that course. You'll see who the course was assigned to, if it was assigned at the time of purchase, as well as the status of the course. Also, if there is a certificate available with the completed training, you'll be able to access and print a PDF version of that directly from this screen here. In the instance that you have codes remaining that were not used yet, you'll be able to email these off and I'll walk you through that process now. When you see your remaining codes here, you simply click on the email codes button. That's going to take you to this screen where you can enter in the email address of the user or users who need to take this training. You can also have the print instructions available from this section here if you just need to print those. Please note that if going this method where you're emailing out the codes to individuals, the quantity will not deplete on your remaining codes until the training has been applied to an account. If you have an individual who has emailed the instructions and they do not need to take this training course, you can simply email the instructions to another individual who does require the training. If you've already applied the training to an account and you need assistance removing this training, you can contact us at help at bistraining.com or you can call us at our toll-free number 1-866-416-1660. Thank you for watching. I hope this helps you with your purchasing process.